to introduce a, a dear friend. By the way, I'm always excited when musicians come to, to hear one of my gigs, and it's even more exciting when they offer to play. Because if you think about it, you know, when you go hear a group, you're hearing you know, a certain number of musicians, because usually that's what the venue can afford. But if you have other musicians just coming, volunteering, offering their talent, then it's like the value of the performance goes up without it costing the house anything more. And uh, then the musicians have this collaboration thing going on. So how about a hand for Mr. Ken Berry, who's going to play tenor sax. Yeah. And uh, by the way, Ken and I have done a lot of gigs together. We were George Howard's rhythm section before he passed away. Not rhythm section, but horn section before he passed away. So we did probably a couple hundred gigs. And I really loved uh, playing with Ken because he's such a wonderful listener, but he's also very lyrical. He comes up with the most beautiful melodies, and he's just as good a jazz player and a Latin player as he is uh, R&B. In fact, he's even done quite a few gigs with the Cuban guys. You may have heard him right here. And so it's a real honor to have How about another hand for Ken Berry and the tenor saxophone? Yeah. We're gonna start with In Your Own Sweet Way. And by the way, Ken, you'll be happy to hear that we followed Art Frank's advice. We're going to double the interlude to 16 bars, which is what he did, and then it was endorsed by Dave Rubeck himself. Um, yeah, it's, it, I mean, it's a modal thing, but it just goes on twice as long. You know, we're going to do it in between solos also. So before the first, we'll, we'll, we'll open. Yeah, that's right, every chorus, that's, that's the way we'll do it. And so we're going to open up with the interlude, and then um, we'll, we'll hit the pen. And then why don't you take the first solo this time? Does that sound good, Ken? Okay. Thank you. 
have a cool version of that. I love that tune, but I think I like it better with that 16-bar um, interlude. Now, I would like to ask your indulgence for a minute because I have a friend that asked to come to do some poetry, and we usually do free jazz accompaniment behind it, but I'd like to make a small suggestion. Let's try the feeling that we had on the interlude at the end, kind of a spacey feeling, and try to see if that works to back her up so it's not so you know modern in tonality and that way I think it'd be easier. So ladies and gentlemen, please put your hands together for Cyria Rose to come to do original poetry. bring me back to you. A vivid rainbow fades to a somber hue. Your memory is like a postcard on the run. Crowded, shrouded graveyard of yesterday's love. Long down the darkest river of my night. That river will always lead me to you. Our deco eyelashes, sacred talisman of Orpheus, the dreamy vision and bloodshot eyes, lightning in the music flashes. It's time to cut the film, give up the ghost, make the kill. Ritualistic eyes fall. Ritualistic runes fall from the corners of your eyes. The clock strikes noon. The cloak crow flies behind the shadow of the moon. So do the wild and lonely cries fade in the night. A word to the winding highway riders of this time. Ill-fated, lucky, or wise. Remember love lost is still holy. Hearts beat like whirling thunder. Shooting star streaks across the night sky. Love can be so kind, but I've mostly found it to be sinister and cold. Quieting the demons of isolation, fueling the heaviest of contemplation. Desperate obsession, repeating the same pattern, never learning the lesson. It's hard to perceive the holy factor of what sometimes feels like a disease. Crawling on my knees, begging you, please, do anything you want, just don't leave. What pain to perceive in this dark reprieve, with tears on the page and blood on my sleeve. Is the intensity of love like the intensity of grief, saturated by fantasy, delusion, and belief? Who are you and who am I? Seems so many confuse love with a desperate need for self-validation. The malcontent, the innocent, the faith healers in the hollow basement, angels in derelict clothes, noble street fighters who have failed, riot squad heroes that spun off the rails, demons in shadow, Romeo's of light, princess of the sea, dancing in delight, sunlight turns to moonlight, winter turns to spring, summer cycles to autumn, time passing starts to sting. Where is my princess? Why hath thee forsaken me, my prince? Is there a reason to believe? The true love makes true sense. Thank you. How about a hand? 
it for Cyria Rose. Cyria Rose, original poetry. Hey, let me tell you, you won't, you won't hear this at very many jazz gigs, but it is at the root of a lot of jazz back in the day of Kerouac. James Baldwin, they, they wrote about a lot about jazz. We're going to do a tune originally written by Charlie Parker. We're going to do Susan Artemis' version, and she's going to sing it.
Ken Berry. Yeah.